Ready for another sanity saver move? Let's do arms this time. Work on that upper body. Now I'm using a chair. You can do this standing, but I would suggest you start in a chair. We all have a lot of distractions at us right now, and by being in a chair, it helps isolate that lower body. So you have a little bit less to think about. Now you still have to keep your core activated, still have to keep alignment, but the chair really helps. So then you can focus a little bit more on that upper body and get more out of it, get a little more release of that tension in the upper body. So start with the chair. Now in the chair, we're usually towards the edge of the chair. We're not sitting all the way back. First, I'm gonna arch and scoop a few times just to warm up that spine a little bit. So hang on to your knees, arch back, shake head now, pull that tummy and inhale. Exhale all the way. Inhale again. And so ribs up and press in above the knees and scoop through, scoop through, but pull that tummy in. One more time, arching back, relax that head, inhale. Exhale, ribs up and scoop through. There you go. So the alignment is knees straight out from the hips, ankles underneath, so make sure you do that. You can cross stretch a little bit, a little bit. Can we call it wiggle wiggle cross stretch? The opposite hips and shoulder just kind of helps settle everything there in the spine. So once you have your activation, we're going to take the outside of those mint chops and drag it in. Inhale, exhale, stretch to get those ribs nice and tall. Shake that head now, head now. Then let release that neck tension. Big inhale, exhale, stretch those thumbs, press into the thighs. On a count of three, we will relax the hands and shoulders, but keep those ribs up. One, two, three, ribs up. There you go. Mint hand away, mint hand away. Lightly press those feet, just lightly. Don't let it take over. Full finger stretch, thumbs, thumbs through thick mud, up through thick mud, thumbs back, shake head. Now again, we're gonna clap out for four. Inhale, exhale, here we go. Clap, thumbs back, two, back, three, back, four, back. Good. Extend those arms straight out. Do a quick check that you are straight out from your shoulder. Sometimes we have one side that likes to drift. You're gonna pinch the middle finger and first finger if you want, and the thumb in donut hands. And when you pinch, you get that lat activation. So think to reach through, like spider woman up and reaching out through there, not just lock elbows, reach through. Bicep curls, think to reach through those elbows as the hands come in. It's not about touching, it's keeping those ribs up, tummy tight, don't arch. Inhale, exhale, now reach out through those hands. Reach out through the elbows, keep them up, and hands. This is weight training without weights. Get that nice long lean muscle, reach out from the core. One more time slow, keep those elbows up. Here we go, shake that head, now inhale. Exhale a little quicker, so in for two, reach out. Keep those elbows high, reaching through from the core. Last set, here you go, ribs up. We're gonna twist, 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 and you're gonna curl just a little bit and hunch, but you're not collapsing, big difference here. Pull that tummy in and hunch, and look out, don't look down. We don't want to strain the neck. These are reverse bicep curls, in towards the armpits. Keep those elbows up, and then reach out. Now, if you're having a hard time, I don't want you craning your neck, turn to the side, turn your chair to the side, okay? So elbows up, reach out, tummy still pulling in here, reach out one more time slow, tummy and reach out. Here we go quicker, so in for two and out, reaching through from the core each time, in for two and out, in for two and out, then twist, twist, twist up. I'm gonna let you relax those hands down we're going to do a tricep stretch. So you have the elbow level of the shoulder, hand on the, just gently, just to your point of position, hand on the back, they're gonna tap. One, two, three, four, ribs up, five, six, seven, eight. Other side, same thing. Gently, just gently, because it feels so sore, doesn't it? Think of those triceps. Nice tall torso, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Kind of wiggle, wiggle. Don't lose form, though. We're going to do the second set, which is a little more advanced. Mitt and chop, drag in, curl that tailbone under using core, stretch those thumbs, inhale. Exhale, stretch those ribs nice and tall, shake head now. Inhale, exhale bigger. One, two, three, ribs up, mitt and hand away. Mitt and hand away, full finger stretch, thumbs, thumbs to the back, press those feet up through thick mud, shake head no, clap out for four. Clap thumbs back, keep breathing and smiling and blinking. There you go, thumbs up, reach away. Now we do it with thumbs up. You will not come in as far, but that's okay. So reach away, make sure you're at the shoulders. Inhale, exhale for sport, full, slow. So in, elbows up, ah, that's a little tighter, isn't it? Don't get in so far, but that's okay. You're feeling it in a little bit differently in that back. And through those triceps, ribs up is really important for triceps. Last time, slow, a little quicker, but don't lose form. Shake that head, no inhale. Exhale, here we go. So in for two, reach away. Reach through those elbows when you bend. Reach through the hands when you extend. Four, there you go. You know what we're doing, right? Curl, hunch, twist, twist, twist. Looking out, not down. Reverse, inhale. Exhale, here we go. So in for two, reach away. Two, reach away. Reaching through those elbows. Four, four more. Five, I didn't do them slow. 
because I know you're about had enough. <laughs> Seven and out, eight and out, up. I'm gonna go ahead and bring those elbows down. We're gonna clap that away, shake head no, clap thumbs back, two, back, three, back, four, back. Relax the feet. Let's do that tricep stretch again, just gently. Tall torso, inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side, tall torso, inhale. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do a couple shoulder rolls, jazz, back for four, two, three, four, then forward, one, and two, and up and back. There you go. Arm moves. You should feel some tightening and toning and a little bit of soreness. This is a great sequence to do. If you're not ready for the bear claws, which is a little more intense, just stick with the donut hands. You can either do both sets with donut hands or just do one set and save two sets for later when you're a little bit stronger. But you should feel really good. You've actually worked your core, you worked your legs by holding the position, you worked your lats, your traps, and those biceps and triceps for greater arms. Yes, we can have sanity saver moves for our mental, emotional, and physical health.